Yes, brother Nasusa, me play come long here. Lord, remind ourselves of the journey that we took long this day. Me play been turning bell, kissing baptized, na kissing Holy Spirit. It's a journey of a narrow gate where me play been behind him. Now you have a old same walk about in shallow kingdom, long God, and me no stop long passing blue body, no God, and me stop long spirit. I just want to tell you, bring him you yet you come. Lord, help him, each and every one of us, that we will stand now, walk in this faith, walk of faith from the day that we started off. Now we should finish off where God and me call him to his eternal uh, destination of inheriting kingdom belong God. For you new Christians, me play, he welcoming you on behalf of founder and principal pastor. You join in fellowship like just a week or two months ago. Now you are taking a young Christian life as a spirit filled your journey on. For all prosperity filled where you've been baptized, low early days of the church, low 80s, 90s, na early 2000s, now you come, you start learning. God, I mean, also have a look, look long, how long we've been in the church. God does not value us from outside perspective. The important about our walking in the things of the Lord is maintaining our spiritual relationship one time God. Every time we play fellowship to remind ourselves of our journey that we took day number one. Time we play harim this play talk lotanim bel kiss him baptized na kiss him holy spirit. It's not an easy road look behind him passing blah big play. Christianity I mean religions where we play adopt him from our eight hundred languages tribal cultures is taplonian. Now, Papua New Guinea, me play, you call him me play at Christian country. But in the midst of Christianity, there is a real experience God the offer him and that is to become spirit filled. So those of you who said you come up spirit filled long time or in the mid years, now you come Lonen, you must look out in spiritual life long you. Me play you come out long here as we are departing distant away from our 40th anniversary, and approaching our first anniversary of the 41st, long September, where I'm by falling, long Friday, long September, first September when fellowship began. Let us remind ourselves from the doors of our 40th anniversary celebration, we, we, we came out with messages, instructions, encouragement, Lord, journey on. What had happened has already happened. It became a history. Today is the gift that the Lord has given to us. So each day we count on our walk with the Lord. Tomorrow is a mystery. That's why it is very important, long, you may remind reminding me of the journey that we took, with the stand that we took. Me play Harim all testimonies. Lord, remind ourselves that we came out from different walks of life to have one experience. You may turn him bell. You may kiss him baptized. Now you may kiss him Holy Spirit. Osamna, make it your aim. Make it your ambition to be in fellowship. Fellowship and established areas. One and your individual fellowship with God. Your individual fellowship with God is the day one beginning of your faith. Your family fellowship with God is another part because we come out from our family homes to come out and worship God. We have to maintain our fellowship with God in our families. And thirdly, our union with one another. Me play come out long, driven, house door, and me play go and say, house meeting fellowship, me play. Sunday or day of fellowship and communion fellowship, you may come down long here. Once again, on behalf to long founder and principal pastor, and a provincial pastor of what must be assembly, we would like to f welcome our family and relatives who said, you joining me, Plalo, this Plalo morning time long fellowship. Your coming is not by coincidence. It's your coming is not by co chance. You come because you like all of heaven, and you come. God, in us, have a force in man, Lord God of heaven. God gives us a freedom of choice. You choose. 
You choose to go. Every time we go shopping and marketing, we choose what we want to take home. One kind long here. Life in Silo Kingdom, long God. It's a choice that we made. It's a decision that we made. Let me play come. Family, friend, today you come. We make decisions every day of our life. Today you made a decision to come and sit down and observe our fellowship. We play to thank you, long God, or Sam, you come. Because God does not leave anybody behind. Some American forces only train him on Navy SEALs or, or British forces. There is instructions where I'll give him time only go out. Law physical operation Blongol. They say take bring them home or leave no one behind. God does not want to leave anybody behind because he prepared a salvation plan for each and every one. God I mean, no bypassing plans Blonem. God I mean, no lose tinting. God made everything possible, available for all of us. Time Emmy Salim picking in Iblon and Jesus Christ, he come. Lord, open him way, Blomipla, gateway, to show us the way into the kingdom. So, family friend, today you come. You sit down. You come because you like all of heaven and you come. You come, Lord, here because you like experiencing God in work, Lord, life long you. There may be prayer, prayer points where prayer petition you make him, Lord, life long you. Now you're waiting for answers. You cannot receive answers unless you ring the right number. God, I mean, you know, save, pass him yaolo prayer. God is a sickle in prayer. God is a look in conditions for prayer. God is a move according to plan and purpose. There are many millions of prayers throughout the world. Only put him the presence for big blah. God attends to the prayer according to his plan and purpose and according to his time. Today you come. You've been praying for changes. Maybe other things. Maybe you come long sick. Today you can't finish. Lord, do a step, Lord God, Lord, then. Do not go out empty. You have heard our testimonies. Brother Susa or testify long miracle work in God. God from eternity to eternity existed from ancient of days that God dealt with life of men. God, he like him, you must he got personal relationship and experience one time man. In our time blow guess believe more. In our time blow me play behind him, tin tin blow, man blow this blow ground more. And me time blow you sit down. You see tell him how are you going with God's business. When in business you make him blow this blow ground, you eat, you eat by making. But in a, as the business grows, there is partnership in business. Government and we make him partnership on them one time churches. Only develop him. Nation of Papua New Guinea. From 50 years on 50 years of the nation building. Papua New Guinea must come one of those rich and black Christian nation. But the Christianity background, the, the fundamental of Christianity is going back to the basics. Going to back to the basics. A nation without God is a dead nation. A nation cannot achieve its goals and um, all ambitions for them inside a nation unless they embrace him godly principles, godly the God direction. So God made Papua New Guinea in a way that our people love God. God, I mean, bypassing Papua New Guinea, time I bring him 40 years ago, the message of repenting, turn him bell. Two, kiss him, baptize the big plawara. Three, kiss him, Holy Spirit, out him, new plaka in top place. In the midst of Christianity of 100 years, God made his final move to the nation of Papua New Guinea, seeing that Papua New Guinea is a land filled with plenty harvest. People of Papua New Guinea, 800 languages only like him, God. You go out to every part of Papua New Guinea, the house line, but you look him house lot to his because people he embrace him Christianity. But we are we are glad, we are thankful that God he raised him man, Namelo Mipla, Lord bring him nothing but the truth, a simple gospel, 
the message that Jesus Christ and me start him. And that message is that every Papua New Guinea, every world who said he like, he go inside the kingdom belong God, must be born again of the water and the Holy Spirit. And other people say, without the born again experience, the doors of heaven will be locked. Without this really Bible born again experience, all our prayers will be hanging on the doorsteps, no answers will come out because God knows who is praying. God answers prayer according to his will and plan and purpose. Family, friend, today you come. Me encourage you, me also. You don't leave this room, this hall, without having personal experience. God now, I mean, lose him. Heaven, true the presence from the Holy Spirit. I mean, talk, talk, true, the picking the name, the name, on same. You play, you know, can lose him, Jerusalem. In up, you play, kiss him, strong. Now, you shall be my witness from Jerusalem, Judea, Samaria, and to the other mounds of the earth. Be play, I mean, been talk, talk, like John 14 and John 16, about the coming of the Holy Spirit. He taught the disciples how to pray. Now one of the teen he mentioned him, he talked, may your kingdom come and may your will be done on this earth. What is the kingdom then? The coming of the kingdom was introduced by the Savior himself. Time Emmy demonstrating the pathway of the coming of the kingdom. After Emmy mentioned him about before let me mention him about the coming of the kingdom. He has to demonstrate the pathway to the kingdom. He was 30 years old. He walked into the waters of baptism. Now John, he baptized him, him, demonstrating the way, the truth, and the life. Matthew 3, 13 to 17. And I blow this blame. He talked to one time Nicodemus. And he talk, unless a man is born again. Born again of the water and the Holy Spirit. Second time I mention him. I'm Nicodemus and I'm confused and I'm talking, how can I be born again? And a big plan, he talking to me, verily I say unto you, if you're not born again of the water and the Holy Spirit, big plan, me point him key areas, will I really be born again. One, and he talk to the water of so baptism. Baptism from the Greek, translation to English means to, to immersion, go down the big water. Baptism, God, and me demonstrating to the picking in the name. Baptism is for adults. Why? Because individuals have to make decision. Baptism is a decision making point. When we have to renounce our old ways, Namipla is starting new life. Baptism is a burial site. Christ died and rose up by the power of God. God erased him after three days. People we plan him or passing no good blood people inside the waters of baptism. Baptism symbolizes burial with Christ. Christ died na mikira beken. Me play plan him or no good blood people inside the waters of baptism. It's not only baptism, but spirit, the anointing. Without the anointing power of God, with the anointing from heaven. Without the anointing of the Holy Spirit, we will not be declared by God. As God and me declared him Christ, time and me kiss him, Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit came down in the form of a dove. In the form of a dove. Now here, the heaven big plan me talk to him. This is my son whom I'm very pleased. God must declare me to play him. We now belong to God. God has to make his declaration. We cannot hear God speaking to us, but God gave us the sign language. God gave the approval, in, approval in, um, proof of being anointed by God. So God gave in his parcel of receiving the Holy Spirit the evidence, the only Bible proof and evidence that a person who is really born again of the water and the Holy Spirit has to speak miraculously in tongues by the power of the Holy Spirit. You may get right talk. So family, friends, today you come, you sit down. Have you got that experience? God is offering practical experience. 
spirit filled man Mary, you got this experience, Lonen. Are you fanning that experience? You still exercise him. Mipla in on up, loose tinting, our fundamental salvation, day one experience. Day one experience. So with that, me like talk talk, Lord, you mill on this plan, morning time. Why there must be revival? Why there must be revival? Family, friends, maybe today you sit down long here. You want plan man or one plan Mary, where you say pray or revival? Why there must be revival? Me like reminding you, me awesome. Without revival, there's no salvation. Without revival, there's no restoration. Without revival, there's no born again experience. Revival is the process. Revival is the spiritual process where one has to go through the heavenly process. Lord, come to the stage where God, I mean, declare him worthy of the kingdom. Anybody, I mean, like prayer, declare him anything. Um, chicken goes through the process. Anything we play, we we'll use him today, he go through the process. Everything today, me play, use him, they go into a process. Heaven, heaven has a process of going in. Our life must be transformed in the likeness of God through the processing, processing of nature by the power of God. Also, I'm not revival. Why there must be revival? You got two plot type revival. One a man made revival. Or literal revival in cultures, not tradition. Lord, reform him all this plan. And the second one is God created revival. He talks about spiritual. In the Christian arena today, plenty man only come up in kind, kind way, come up in revival, belong all, so that they experience. The revival God and me talk talk long name. But time God and me talk talk long revival long name. It was none other than the coming of the Holy Spirit and in filling of people by the Holy Spirit. And today, message based long here is spiritual revival. God created revival. Why there must be a true spiritual revival? Why there is a is a real need for a true Bible-based revival. Bible scripture-based revival is God's divine way to restore man's relationship with God since creation of man. Then God and me make him man. Now man and me die long sin. Now six. Now die and me come. Man now must go back long process, long heavenly process or spiritual process to be revived by God through the spiritual process. So one, the revival God, let me talk long name, it's a Bible or scriptural based revival is God's divine way to restore man's relationship with God since creation of man. Number two, why there must be revival? It is God's spiritual process of salvation in terms of one, Forgiveness. Without revival experience, there will be no forgiveness of sin. Without revival experience, there is no restoration of life or resurrection from spiritual death since creation. Three. Why there must be revival? Revival opens the door for anointment from God. Receiving of the Holy Spirit to bear, number four, salvation. Without the receiving of the Holy Spirit, there is no salvation. Christ, I mean, demonstrate him as a son of God, as a savior, as a redeemer, that he left heaven for a purpose to die for our iniquities. 
He demonstrated anybody, any man, any woman who said he like him access into kingdom must go to what he has demonstrated. So there is no anointing without having a spiritual revival process. And that is salvation. Plenty of people only now walk about and need the grace belong God or Mary Mary belong God. But beyond grace is the salvation door that still opens. We cannot stop at grace alone, but we have to go beyond grace to see that there is the door that is opening for salvation. Faith through the work of grace through the Lord Jesus Christ and with the Holy Spirit brings us to salvation. There is no bypass protocols. There is no shortcut protocols of God's salvation plan. How revival may be walk? Why there must be revival? How revival may walk? Revival must be ignited by God's power, the spiritual power of Holy Spirit. You may agree to talk. Now that it changes me, play talk talk on end. God he heal him sick for me. God he heal him married for me. God he heal him. All situation for me. Now me stop on end. Because God ignited a revival within each and every one of us. You may agree to talk. Secondly, revival will only happen at God's appointed place. Many people pray for revival to happen. Arenas only stop on end. But God, God's revival happens at God's appointed place. When I have God, I make him on end. God, I may come up in revival. And God, he led the nation of Israel out on end. God did not give his laws to Egypt. God has to take the nation of Israel, he come out, now Emmy must come out to Mount Blonen, Mount Sinai, and then from there he has to give his law. God, Israel come up in revival, Blonen, Lord, place Emmy appoint him. And people who want to be revived by God has to find that appointed place. It's not on the mountain, nor anywhere else. God is our appointing only one place where Emiati Makim Lonen. And that anointing place is place where one one Emi anoint him all, now all gather together in worship of God in spirit and in truth, and that is the appointed place. You may agree to gathering of the spirit filled people where only come up Christian through the really Bible born again experience. And that place becomes the anointing place of God's revival to grow. Revival and me grow. Number three, revival will only come through God's appointed and chosen vessel or instrument. No self-declaration. We cannot create our own revival and then say, I'm a, I'm a, I have a revival here. God must declare him you or him. Now, Emmy must put him you go inside the system. Now, Emmy declare him you or him. You are now a revivalist. And that revival experience, where individually he must get on them, is the true Bible born again experience. John 3, 3 to 5, Acts 2, 38. You may agree with Without those Bible principles, me plan in on up God is a true revival. Number five something. God must, four something, sorry. For something, God must confirm his dwelling presence in the midst of his chosen people or vessel. Practically, confirming, confirming with provisions of divine healing, divine signs, wonders and miracles present in the congregation of his chosen. Healings, divine healings, signs, wonders, and miracles. I mean, demonstrating God's presence in the place where Emmy created him, this plan revival. So that God's people all by looking. Now, Emmy talk, there is God among us. There is healing God among us. There is miracle working God among us. There is wonder working God among us. And we bring him offer Blomipla, life Blomipla, awesome sacrifice. And we give our honor and our adoration in worship, in spirit, and in truth to God who said he created him this plan. 
Number five, something. God's revival happens out of one separation. People he like remain low one and like half long all now. They pray for revival. Revival cannot happen that way. God's revival happens in a person's life that man has to come out and be separate. God he took him Abraham. You leave your home, your kindred. You go out now by me showing you this ground where and by come up ground blow you, na tubuna blow you, na tubuna blow you, na tubuna blow you. Abraham came out by faith and he separated himself according to God's direction. 2 Corinthians chapter 6, 14 to 17. Paul he write the Corinthian churches, Lord, come out and be separate. When I'm happy, we're passing no good stuff, Lord, then money like creating revival, in and up creating revival. When I'm happy, we're talking no good, na God, yeah, man, na kill him, man, posting sangu, my stuff, Lord, then money talk, talk, like creating revival. Revival, in and up come up, Lord, then. If you are a person praying for revival, you have to come out and be revived by God in his God's appointed place. You may talk. Yeah. And that's what we did. Me play no man, marry nothing, and me play come up. One way or the other, we have religion backgrounds. We were, you know, leaders in our fellowship. Whether it be a woman leader or man leader, a pastor. Why do we have to leave those places to come out? Because it was God's calling to us. It's not by coincidence. It's not by co-chance we came out. So God now, let me talk to them, is separation. People must come out, Lord, passing no good blood, this blood ground, to a neutral place. Now by God, he rouse him no good long all. Now God, by reviving life long all, time let me give him Holy Spirit long all. That's God's heavenly process. Why there must be revival? Fanning of God's spiritual revival. Spirit filled people. You may turn in bell, you may kiss him baptized. Forty years ago has gone. Forty years from me place at the back. We are going to celebrate our 41 anniversary. As a new generation coming out from the 40th anniversary. Like all Israel have been making blood in. A spirit filled fellowship. This year by celebrating 41 years. What are you looking at the future? What have you learned from the previous 40 years? What is your vision for tomorrow? As a church. As a family. As a congregation. As a spiritual overseers. So we have to see that. When I'm something, he make him revival, blah, me, blah. God and me like him, this like revival must continue. How about this like revival, I must like to learn. You may must behind him, tin, tin, blah, God. Like, blah, God. Way, blah, God. Now, God, by bless him, this like revival, where all money pray, Lord, him. Where God and me make him possible, Lord, me, blah. Fanning of God's revival comes to two blah, areas. Preservation and protection of the revival fundamental culture and doctrine. You like move away the fundamental Bible beliefs, Bible way blow, you got a born again experience. Now you like come up in way blow, you yet not according to God's way, you'll be with, in error with God. Because God's scriptures are final decision making point. If we want to add unto the scriptures, we are error with God. If you want to do away with scriptures, we are we in error with God. Leave the scriptures as it is being anointed. They are inspired scriptures. We cannot go wrong by walking on the scriptures. So fanning of the revival, fire blow revival must light all get something. Preservation and protection of the revival fundamental doctrines. Zero tolerance to no compromise. Zero tolerance. God, you know, like a man, Mary, where is an apple to play leg? Now me talk, me blow God. Now me blow this black ground. God, you know, like him, I think, suppose, inside of Billy, blow name, time, and me make him you 
a born again believer. You know, Napsanap. Go ahead and me talk to the Laodicean church. You be neither cold or hot, I'll spew you out. Time me like a promise him, me play talk half hot, na half cold, he stop lonen. It provokes God to anger. Who are you? Who are you to make such decision? Lo provoke him God to anger. I'm a God. Me lot along you. Me can make him do something. Me can go and look him or can can pass him no good. And me can come lot to me can walk him or this la pass him no good. It's a separated life. God in you know, all like him. All picking any where only kai kai lo table blown in. Na only go out na kai kai lo table blown. Man no good. Paul right, the Corinthian church, and I'm talking, you cannot eat from the table of the Lord, and you shall go and eat from the table of the evil one. And we provoke him, God, to danger. Spirit-filled people, you cannot do that. You're cutting off your relationship. You're cutting off the doors of your blessings. So today, you may look, look, long this plan. Let me lose him one time. Me one plus scripture at us all. Open our Bible to Haggai. Haggai chapter 1, verse 8 to 9. Me share him this prescription to remind ourselves. Of the last 40 years, me play Kisim Lun and me play come out. There is a journey ahead of us. Time Israel all been go captivity to Babylonian after Lohir. And Babylon Empire. Nabuknachia one time on. Army Blonemi come and surround him, Jerusalem, they took captivity. Now after the captivity, Babylon Empire was overthrown by Syrian Empire. Now Cyrus now, and we make him agreement, Lord, bring him. Bring, bring him all Israelites, go back and rebuild him temple. So this was the time where, the time long, Jerubabel, now he kiss him, all captivity, only go inside. Now their reason was to rebuild the temple. Now time only come inside, finish Lord Haggai. Let me read Lord then. Only start him this place, walk, Lord, rebuild him temple. But after 16 years of build, building the temple, all remnant Israelites who said been go back, Lord then, they moved away from the focus of building the temple. Only move away of building the temple. Now they fell into their own personal affairs. Also now God must raise him Haggai. Lord remind him. Remind him the Israelites of their first focus and their calling to come. Spirit filled man Mary, you turn him back. You kiss him baptized, now you kiss him Holy Spirit. You were called to build God's spiritual temple. God is building a nation out of many nations. God is building a church out of many churches. God is building a people out of many people. And spiritual people are the body of Christ. You mean what God and me broke down color skins. God and me broke down all cultures, differences. God he broke down kind, kind way in a passing blow all get a man. Now God he building people he come with one experience. Paul and me write to the Jew on, all Christians, and I'm talk. God, let me know, show him favoritism. God, let me honor him. Commitment, blow name, and a plan, blow name, as a God. Neither Jew or Gentile. Me, plow, all get a mask, come up, new plow, water, and the Holy Spirit. Lord, make him one people. So, out of the Jews, he has to come out spirit filled. Out of the Gentile, he has to come out spirit filled. Man, Mary, kiss him, Holy Spirit. Now, all come up spiritual Israel. That is the spirit filled church. So God now he talk him Haggai. Lo mouse lo Haggai, let me talk talk long here. Me read him, na you may finish him talk long God. Let me talk talk long here, Haggai chapter 1. Now verse 7, you go to 8. Thus says the Lord, consider your ways. Go up to the mountain and bring wood and build the temple. That I may take pleasure in it and be glorified, says the Lord. 
Lo here verse 9 and me talk about them. You look so much, but need it come. You look for much, but indeed it came little. And when you brought it home, it blew it, it blew I blew it away. Why, why, says the Lord of because of my house is in ruin, while every one of you runs to his own house. Man Mary belong God, you turn him bell, you kiss him baptized. You got one one experience, blow you lot day one. Time you kiss him, Holy Spirit. You saw God working in action. God answer in prayer belong you. God you look him healing them take place. You know pray yet and something may come up. Are you still having those experiences? That's a question. This play experience I missed up one time you or no God. Or now you start to pray, pray long for time, look kiss him answer. Are you still praying? Because God is of answer in prayer. God am nice black God to us. On some not here, or point to me like losing one time you me all get Lord, remind ourselves of this great why there must be revival. I need to talk talk Lord Haggai. Number one point, God and me talk talk. Lord Haggai, and me talk awesome. Consider your ways. Every day with God is considering our ways. You care up the morning, you must look, 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 walk about long you. Are we working worthy of the kingdom? Or me play losing focus? Consider our way, 2 Corinthians 13, 5. We examine ourselves. Me play sickle him, I blow me play. Me play sickle him, talk, talk, blow me play. Me play sickle him, walk about, blow me play. Me play sickle him, walk, bless, blow me play. Me play sickle him, sit down, sleep, blow me play. Now me play sickle him, bell, blow me play. Consider your ways. God, let me call upon Lord, every spirit feel. Lord, today, Lord, consider our ways. Secondly, go up to the mountain. Go to the presence of God. Consider your way. If you are lacking wisdom, go to the presence of God. If you are lacking healing, go back to God. If you are lacking other things where you look at you be fallen in, only go back and consider your way and go to God again. Go up to the mountain. Number three, cut wood. Cut wood or someone them. Suppose sample of life, plum me to plan. Divide, also walk him, also walk him maintenance. How's he gonna divide me back up on end? Or carpenters are coming and replace him. What a horse and me Brooklyn end. Join me Brooklyn and all this I'm working maintenance. So here, cut wood. God, let me talk to Brooklyn. One of them kind wood. You go back now, look at the scriptures. Look at your basic salvation. You look at your basic prayer life. Are you still reading the word of God? Are you still praying in the power of the Holy Spirit? Are you still exercising what you have exercised early days of your faith? Are you sharing? Or greedy come inside? Do you forgive or you having bitterness? Lord here. Something plus spirit, me must go back, na kiss him back or some new plot divide and replace him. Suppose prayer life you and me glack and then go back and you exercise in prayer again. Bible reading life lo me to play and me go down can go back and exercise in reading talk long God. If our fellowship with one another is lacking, go back and revive those fundamental things because this is God's way. Build the temple, number, number three something. Build in body block Christ. Everybody has to contribute to the building of the body of Christ. We share our testimony. We bring our love offering. We bring our kindness. We bring our experience. We bring our tithes and give it to build physical needs blood church. At the same time, Mipla, he encourage him one plan, one plan. Lord, testimony plan, one plan. Now, one plan, he build him. If somebody is lacking wisdom, we encourage him. If somebody is lacking physical things, we plan, hold him hand and talk no. Emia, hap kolosi ay goya. Liglik sayarin ay golana. Hap kai kai, mitu plan kai kai. Because mitu plan, he no plan, this plan ground. Mi plan, he walk, lo pain him, this plan city by car. Are we sharing? 
Oh, mi play cre, mi play stop na sabe pesi bum lo wan plakona. How about our widows? Are we concerned about them as a spirit filled widows? How about our orphanage? Are we concerned or we are looking at ourselves? God, I'm not sing out him. One plak kind man ta solika. He got Mary man and me lose him and me come. He got man Mary and me die pinch and me come. He got picking in mama papa. He broke married and he go na picking in. Only try and try me go na no got all pain in him. Church is the place where they can live. They can f- find direction. They can find hope. They can start a new new life. Now through the guidance of the spirit filled walking, spirit filled encourage him now. The young generation go out and say, yeah, I found a family. Are we doing that? Or have we become self-centered? Are we short-sighted? So here, build a temple. Number four, four, God will take pleasure in it. God, he like bless him, church, blow them. God, he like make him church, blow them, he's an upstrong. God, he not like look him, church, blow them, he put down. God, he like him, he's healing, must have been shallow, church, blow them. God, I mean, like, look him. Signs, wonders, miracles, he stop in shallow shows, blow them. God, I mean, like, look him. All man, Mary, blow them. Picking in it, blow them. Only pray. Now, only look him. God, he walk, lo life, long all. Only no struggle, lo life, long all. Only must look him. Healing, sign, wonders, miracle. All picking in it, Mary, only look him. Miracle, and tap, lo suspend, na plate, blow all in shallow house, to a blow. All walk, man, Mary, blow them. Only find him. God, he touch him, pay, pay, get, blow all. Only find him, all man, Mary. Well, only stop with some stakeholders, lo support him, walk, lo big plan. God is blessing business, blood and only grow. Now in return, they give back to support the work of the Lord, the growing of the kingdom. God want to want, will take pleasure in his church. God is waiting for this moment for all of us. Finally, and will be glorified. God is like Bilashim Shosh Blonen. God wants to build his church, a church of the testimony of Jesus Christ. A church bearing the testimony of the Pentecostal, real Pentecostal experience. God, I mean, like, look him, church, blow him, and we operate law, order, discipline, power, inside clean, outside clean, inside power, outside power, inside change, outside change. God, behind all time, and we look him, I mean, I'm a master, blow him. When I'm something, I make him, blow him, and by blessing. So we are in the process of beautifying the church. Every spirit field has a responsibility. We all have a concern. Me plan must build him. And me no work for one plan man, one plan brother, so that's all. And me work for you, me all get up. So God want to glory, be glorified. God is like blessing church, blow them. God is like kissing church, blow them. He call a kingdom where me talk to blow them. Kingdom blow picking in blow them. And by come some king blow, get a king, a big blow, blow, get a big blow. And the days is the greatest world moment. You may look him Russia, if I want them Ukraine law, YouTube, na Facebook, or whatsoever. But the coming of the Lord is not by secret coming, so called all call him rapture. God is coming to take his church away to be glorified. Time be playing me hunger up the crowd, Revelation 1 7. The Lord will come in upon thousand upon thousand. Now I'm by Ronnie come on top, King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Lord kiss him church blown in. Are you ready to be glorified? Are you ready? Suppose me asking you me now, who said ready to go to heaven? Suppose inside the bell blow, you talk about me ready to go to heaven. You are prepared. You are ready to be glorified. But inside the bell blow, you me, if we say, uh, meeting past time, I'm not God. With God, there's no eating, no suppose. We came to the truth. And the truth is the truth. When you remain in the truth, God offers only truth. There's no such in as ifs and buts. And so now God, he like glorified church. Are you ready to be tra- changed in the twinkling of an eye? That's a question that we will go with us. Today, you may go back. Remind ourselves. If we are gone on the other side, now you may know God. You may now have to go, go back and pick up the fundamentals. Suppose you may not maintain him. All the fundamentals. You may not can point him finger or pick it in it. By all the talk, I say, I've been hurting myself. 
Tu bona blo mi. Oli bin tok to che revival le mi kama blo nenia. Ai ai pasi luk luk. Mau pasi tok tok. Na oli to na mi pleno film now. Sabos di plaka in story i kama all brother na susa e mi no gupla story. God is a practical God. Revival blo namba continue until last trumpet sound. I me agarai to. God, Amy, by God, preservation, blood, revival, blood, name. God, by protecting, revival, blood, name. Anybody who said, like, Sabrak, now, other man, like, Edim, Lord, this blood, revival, God will always do, do anything, everything possible, Lord, maintain him until picking in him, blood, name, he come. Now, kiss him, this blood, shows, blood, name. Holy Spirit, church, spirit filled, church, speaking in tongues, church, healing, sign, wonders, miracle, working, church, and we go inside for eternity. Spirit filled. You may not have seen that one time mistakes. You may must maintain him culture of revival. You yet you save how about you walk about one time this blood God. You may not pick it in and you may come to him. We have our young children coming up. We have the youths coming up. We have our Sunday school coming up. They only must experience him. This blood revival may experience him alone. We cannot leave them behind. Leave no one behind. We must not leave our next generation behind. And they are lost for eternity. We cannot leave our fourth generation behind without experience. We cannot rise from the grave to tell them how to worship this God. Today, I blow me play look look yet. I blow me play harim yet. Me play pull him win yet. Kilok blow me play palm yet. Pass on this revival experience to our children. Pass it on. Suppose picking in him long you. You start to pass him on legally grasp on end. That means you are not passing on the revival culture. Suppose your mama, papa, that's all you pray. Now, picking any blow, you know, pray. You are not passing on the revival culture. Revival is of a grow, not passing on experience. So let us pass on and build the revival culture, a generation revival. Generation revival in me You may look out in Pible and Holy Spirit. You may pick him, go pick in the nipple, you may look out him, this is the Bible, Holy Spirit. Suppose big play, you know, come. Tupuna, number two, Tupuna, blow me, blow, look out, this is the Bible, Holy Spirit. Number three, Tupuna, number four, Tupuna. Now, God, by blessing me, you will not rise from the grave to see your great grandson or daughter worshiping God in spirit and in truth. You will not be there because we are going for an eternal sleep. We will go back to the dust. Now, every time, blow me, blow. Lord, this blood revival, God, he created him, the nation of Papua New Guinea, Lord, protect him, Lord, preserve him, now live in it, walk in it, sleep on it, and talk on it. For our family and friends, today you come, you've been praying for revival. God, he bring him, finish, Lord, do up, Lord, you. He got this personal revival. You're not going to go out long here. God is offering this. Today you heard him talk long, God. You like God, you walk one time, you. You like God, you heal him six or long, you. Number one sub step, you must kiss him, Lord, then. You must go, now, join him, you yet one time, God past time. You kiss him, spirit, block God past time. That's the foremost things. You restore him, you yet, the spiritual revival must take place, and the physical transformation will come later. If you're coming for a physical healing, you go for your spiritual healing first. You kiss him, spiritual medicine past time. Now, physical medicine by come behind helping me. If you're thinking of your restoration on a marriage life, okay, now you have to arrange your relationship with God, go inside. Now you establish him, new plan relationship with a big plan. Too long, you come up, new plan of water and the Holy Spirit. You turn him back. You kiss him baptized, you kiss him Holy Spirit. There will be an altar call. After all, this plan talk to God. Me plan no, me plan no ready, ready class because kingdom of God they come now. Today is the day of salvation. You sit down low here, you sit down one time, who side sit down on the front blow you, who side sit down on the left hand side blow you, front blow you, backside blow you. But today you sit down now. Are you ready to go to heaven? Do you want to be glorified when the trumpet sounds? If your answer is no, then there's something wrong with you. If you want to, and your answer is yes, how would it happen? Just say yes to the Lord. Simple yes. God is like him, simple yes, blow you. God, you know, like him, when money or cargo bills blow you, God is waiting for your simple answer. Yes, Lord, I want to be. So you observe that you sit down long here. 
God is going to wait for you, yes. I'll talk all by calm. You know, continue low side. Life blow you, life blow you. Die blow you, die blow you. Seek blow you, seek blow you. God is calling to it today. Spirit fill. You look at him, fire blow, Holy Spirit. You may I talk. You may talk, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You may talk, thank you, Lord. Big play me down. You may pass in my. Now you may pray, Lord, good news. Now I'll call back and behind. You may pray, big play me pray. Praise your name. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Big play me pray, Lord, thank you.